A Moment in Wine with Fred Tregaskis, underwritten by Summit Wine Cellars, located in Ridgefield, Connecticut, 203-916-1664. You'll find them on the web, summit-cellars.com. Hi, welcome to A Moment in Wine. This is Fred Tregaskis, where we're tasting wines from around the world. And today we're going to one of my favorite places, Argentina. We're going to be tasting uh, the Miguel Flores uh, Torantes. Uh, now, Torantes is an interesting grape uh, found in Argentina, Uruguay, Chile, um, and it's just a wonderful, distinctive white fresh grape that um, makes a wonderful wine that's perfect for the upcoming summer days. Um, it is usually grown in high elevations where there's some extreme temperature uh, fluctuation, which gives this wine some uh, great character. It's not unlike mm, Riesling or Albarino uh, in its quality. It has some sweetness up front and uh, depending on the uh, producers, more complexity at the end. Um, but anyway, let's, let's look at this. We're tasting, again, the Miguel Flores Torantes um, from Mendoza, Argentina. Um, and the first thing I notice, um, it has a beautiful, just a sparkling gold uh, straw-like color. Uh, it's very translucent. Uh, it's almost glowing uh, gold here. Uh, but as I'm swirling it in the glass, I'm getting some fantastic aromas of peaches and honey. Maybe some rose petal. Uh, just a, it's a very sweet nose. Uh, but what's really fun, mm, as I taste it, it's not at all sweet. It's it's minerally, it's briny, um, very dry, and uh, so it's quite surprising compared to the nose that it, that it offers. Um, and it has it, and right in the front. It's good fruit. Again, I'm getting like that dried rose petal thing going on. Uh, peaches, maybe some honeysuckle. As it goes mid palate, it's really stony and minerally, and just the cleanest, purest finish at, uh, um, at the end of the uh, at the end of the flavors. Um, mm, I'm just sitting here uh, loving the kind of briny uh, end to this uh, this wine. Uh, I think. Matching this wine with spicy Asian food, uh, maybe uh, a ch spicy Indian chicken dish, or um, even raw oysters might be a good thing to have with this wine. Uh, just, just lovely. Uh, and a big difference between this and say Sauvignon Blanc or Chardonnays and um, other white wines that are more commonly found. I uh, found I highly recommend. Uh, that people check out Torontes if they want to explore a little bit, and it's wonderfully affordable. Um, again, we're drinking the uh, Miguel Flores Torontes from Mendoza, Argentina. 